You have entered the Alice pod. Take a seat, sit back, and relax. Hello! So today's video, I am building a Parkshaw house share, um, ready for the Ferent pack. This is completely basic, and I've done it this basic purely because I'm going to use it as a starter apartment block area house share thing for the for rent pack just so I can get used to how you allocate rooms and shared slash communal areas and I thought it would be easier to do it like this um, especially if you're going to be a living landlord because there is a bigger room in this complex in this house share um, for the landlord to live so you can sort of get a feel for the new pack and what I'm wondering is how this is going to work in terms of what will there have to be in these buildings like you know when you do a park or a residential or whatever you get a list of things that have to be in this lot to be a functional rental slash house share whatever you want to call them apartments so i wonder if you'd have to have a water heater uh, the water tank um electrical box is that mandatory do you have to have a basement with that stuff in can that be on the main floor so i'm not so sure and we'll have to just wait and see but this is exactly why i'm building this kind of build just so I can get a full feel for this new gameplay and how everything works without it being all crowded and on top of each other in different floors because personally I find that's a bit confusing a bit too much when I'm trying to figure out what a new pack does so that there the mailbox I saw in the trailer and the gameplay trailer that there's mailboxes similar to that but they have like three or four different hall spaces letterbox areas so that you can have you know multiple mail deliveries to the same complex i am so excited for this pack i'm hoping it's gonna be you're gonna be able to see the people's rooms like so you don't have to travel to each unit and go through a loading screen i'm hoping you can just sort of as if you just live all living in the same house and there's no loading screens and such to move the different units in your apartment block so with this build as you can see um if you can hear that scratching it's my dog she is scratching my sofa no panic it's fine as you can see with this build there is four rooms i am not certain those four rooms i think there's four rooms and there's like um, there's going to be shared areas like this will be the living room this will be the dining area slash study um, library office the whole shebang with the dining area and that's the kitchen again i'm going to use that as a um, open space a shared space so this is going to be sort of more like a house share slash dorm rooms university vibe because i feel like that's sort of gonna work best to begin with to get a feel for the everything you're doing in the pack and everything you need to do and the whole all these new rules and stuff and I'm wondering because they've changed when you upload to the gallery you can have nine beds so I'm wondering if that means you can have eight people living in your house nine including you as the landlord or is it nine families uh, eight families I'm not sure so anyway we'll do a quick tour here we've got that'll be the living area the living room space TV fireplace section whatever you want to put there this will be the study area with the dining kitchen as uh, blah, 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 blah. as i showed you before we're gonna go straight into this bedroom on the right i think yes so we're just gonna have a quick look in the bedrooms there's no furnishings because 
I imagine there's quite a bit of stuff that's going to come with the new forum pack that you can sort of deck it out with. And personally, I get so stressed out trying to furnish my build. I am not a furnisher. I'm more of a builder. So as you can see, these are similar size rooms. And then you've got this other room here, which is a bigger room. And it's got an ensuite bathroom. And this is if I was... When I'm playing the Ferrant Pack, I will be using it as the landlord's room slash my room. But you can use it as just a bigger family room. You could put a couple of beds in there. And then this is the public shared, not public, but it's the shared bathroom that will be for all the other people in the house. And that is it. This is the end of this tour and this video. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned for more as I will definitely be doing more for the Ferrant Pack. Thank you for watching, stay tuned for more, uh, subscribe, like, comment, bye!